Should you plant your roots in Dallas or Fort Worth? We've experienced massive growth throughout DFW, and many are moving here because of affordability, family, but the number one reason, relocation. With so many major companies moving to Texas, their employees are planting their roots in Texas. The question I often get asked is Fort Worth or Dallas? So let's take a dive into what each of these cities offer. Welcome back, or if you're new around here, welcome. I'm Amanda Ryan, your Dallas Fort Worth realtor who shares all tips on DFW real estate. Let's start this video off with Fort Worth and what Fort Worth is known for. Nicknamed Cowtown for its deep roots in the cattle ranching industry, Fort Worth has a rich and diverse cultural history. Get a taste of true American West at the stockyards. Filled with shops, restaurants, live music, and museums. Embracing its culture, the Fort Worth herd lets its cattle roam the street every day, twice a day. And Neal Alley is a vibrant district with carriage rides, horses, live music, and some of the best outdoor patios. Sundance Square is one of the prettiest spots in town. Located in the heart of historic downtown Fort Worth, you'll find so much to do. Sundance Square really embraces the outdoors, so you'll likely see yoga classes, movie nights, and dancing waterfall shows. And most importantly, check out Sundance Square during the holidays. It's magical. TCU is one of the most important universities in the state. No matter where you are in Fort Worth, the color purple surrounds you. Texans take pride in their purple horned frogs. Fort Worth wouldn't be much of a cowboy city without a rodeo. Each year, Fort Worth hosts a rodeo and livestock show. All the famous cowboys and cowgirls head into town and it's 23 days of bull riding, horse shows, live music, parades, carnivals, and so much more. This thing is legendary. It's not just a slogan, it's why the Fort Worth Stock Show and Rodeo is the most authentic Western lifestyle experience anywhere, since 1896 actually. It's exciting, it's fun, and it's 23 days of what makes Fort Worth great. Fort Worth embraces its deep roots and has so much to offer. Now, let's switch gears and head 30 miles east to Dallas. If you love tall buildings and all that the big city has to offer, then Dallas is where you'll want to call home. Deep Ellum is known as an artsy area with some of the best outdoor art. The streets are lined with vibrant art, building murals, and the area is home to unique art galleries, as well as more than 30 live music venues. Dallas Arboretum is a 66 acre botanical garden in one of the top botanical gardens in the world. It's hands down one of the most beautiful outdoor attractions in Dallas. With breathtaking displays and exhibits, there is so much to take in here. Clyde Warren Park is a five acre park that sits on top of Rogers Freeway. This isn't your average park. Filled with tennis tables, badminton, chess, a splash pad, and an open playground that hosts live concerts and yoga. We can't forget about the line of food trucks that sit on the outer edges of the park. Lower Greenville is a quaint neighborhood filled with a robust scene of bars and an ever-increasing number of noteworthy restaurants. The streets are always buzzing with activity, especially at night when it's exciting nightlife scene. The perfect spot to keep high energy going after a show at the Granada Theater just up the street. At this point, you're probably loving Fort Worth for its deep Western roots and Dallas for its city vibes. No matter if you're leaning more towards Dallas or Fort Worth, you won't be disappointed by calling DFW your home. And if you're looking to call Texas home, our team would be honored to help you make that move. Visit our website onthemovedfw.com to download our relocation guide and learn even more about what Dallas-Fort Worth has to offer. Give me a thumbs up or comment if you found this video helpful. And if you really like this video and wanna hear from us weekly, then be sure to subscribe and turn notifications on. I'll see you on the next video.